All right, so to go with our dinosaurs, we can make um, some dragon fire breath. So I just cut um, two strips of your regular uh, tissue paper that you use for um, gift wrap. And I'm going to cut it into little strips about an inch and a half wide and maybe five inches long. You don't have to measure it out, just kind of eyeball it. But this is what you're going to use to make your fire. So I cut a um, paper towel roll in half. And what I'm going to do first is I am going to take some tape and tape the um, tissue paper into the inside of my paper towel roll. And you can use a bunch, you can make these longer if you want longer fire, if you want shorter fire, however you want. You can cut it into, instead of strips, you can cut it, cut it into flames. Whatever you decide to do. It's just cute and fun. But you just tape it on in the inside. is no good. Okay. So that way, you might want to make these longer, but that works when you blow into it. Then, I have some paint that I used for something different. My uh, dragon is going to be yellow. But you can paint your paper towel roll or your toilet paper roll. I'm just using a film brush. Oops. And All right, so that is the first part of the dragon, and um, you can use cotton balls or um, pom poms or color your cotton balls, whatever you want. But I'm gonna make the eyes, so I'm gonna use two little pom poms. I'm gonna put just a dot of glue there and place my googly eyes on there. Again, if you don't have googly eyes, you can just use the pom-poms, that's fine too. And then, I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna put a dot of glue on the side so that I can stand it up on my paper towel roll. And those will be my dragon eyes. And if you want, you can use two smaller um, pom poms to make the nose, or I'm just going to use um, a marker. 
make sure the paint is dry. And I'm going to draw two circles for his nostrils. And there you have it. You've got little dragon breath. Have fun. Bye.